Welcome to another edition of Biloxi A to Z, the insider's guide to what's happening in Biloxi. This is being recorded for Friday, March the 3rd, 2023. Well, it's a new month, which means a new issue of B News Monthly has arrived. We'll give you the details on the issue. We'll also tell you how to keep up with road closures and traffic issues, and we'll give you some ideas for the weekend. We begin with the March B News Monthly. The 28-page newsletter, which just arrived in homes and businesses throughout Biloxi, has details on the big happenings this month, including the St. Patrick's Day festivities. Those festivities will take place on March the 11th and include Grilling on the Green, a 5K run, and the Hibernia Marching Society's St. Patrick's Day Parade. In the issue, you'll also find some details on the return of the U.S. Air Force Thunderbirds for the Thunder Over the Sound Air Show taking place in late April. you hear about the new High Hop Creative District that is planned for downtown and take a look at the downtown string lighting. Garrett Green with the Biloxi Shuckers offers a peek into the new baseball season at MGM Park. The Biloxi Parks and Recreation Department tells adults ages 50 and older how they can get involved in community activities. And those interested in attending the Mississippi Coding Academy can find out how to apply for the next class. You'll also read about the new Rouse's Market Plan for West Biloxi, the upcoming State of the City presentation, Keesler Field in the Back in the Day column, and events taking place throughout the month of March in the community calendar. The newsletter also includes infrastructure maps and columns from the Biloxi VA and Keesler Air Force Base. If you live outside the city limits of Biloxi, you can view the newsletter on the city's website. Just go to bluxy.ms.us and then click here. Each weekday, the city's engineering department posts updated traffic information and details on road closures. To see the latest information, visit the traffic page on the city's website by clicking here. And don't forget to sign up for Be Alert, the city's text messaging system for on-the-go traffic advisories. Just text Biloxi to 99411. The Biloxi City Council held its last meeting for February 2023 on Tuesday at Biloxi City Hall. The meeting was recorded and streamed live. To see the meeting recording and an archive of past recordings on the city's YouTube page, click here, then click here. And it's flu season and COVID-19 is still around. Please follow safety protocols to lessen the spread of the viruses to others. The weekend weather forecast calls for cool evenings in the mid-50s to low 60s and daytime highs in the mid-70s under sunny skies. To start the beautiful weekend, the first Friday and downtown block party returns tonight at 5 p.m. The public is invited to join this festive party for food, fun, and music. The event is in a new location at the corner of Bone and Howard Avenue. Also tonight, Gallery 782 celebrates its 14th year in the heart of downtown Biloxi. Meet the artists and see their beautiful works of art. Everyone is invited to this reception which includes food, beverages, and door prizes. Johnny Mathis celebrates 66 years known as the Voice of Romance. Mathis performs his timeless classic melody Saturday night at the Beau Rivage Resort. Well, Hiller Park will be closed to the public Saturday from 7 a.m. till 10.30 for the Shenanigans 5K Fun Run. Nativity BBM School hosts this event in memory of Principal Sister Mary Jo Mike. Race day registration begins at 7 a.m. with a one-mile fun run at 8 and the 5K at 8.30. Experience thrilling rides and amazing views of the Mississippi Sound at the Margaritaville's Paradise Pier Fun Park. The park is now open daily with 15 different amusement park rides, including a 180-foot observation wheel overlooking the Gulf of Mexico. The wheel features enclosed air-conditioned gondolas and a light display after sunset. And remember, the Penta Sailing Museum replica is located at the Schooner Pier in East Biloxi. They're offering tours until she sails away April 2nd. Tickets to this event and all events mentioned are available by visiting the various venues' websites. And to see a list of what's happening throughout the month, check out the Biloxi Community Calendar in the March issue of B News Monthly. It can also be viewed on the city's website by clicking right here. 
We leave you today from the waterfront with views of Deer Island. Have a great weekend and we'll see you again next week.